HPL Canada and Transcape South Africa welcome you to the 2021 Virtual Transcape Race Series. The Transcape Mountain Bike Experience was created by Lenore and Wayne Collett in 2011. It is a seven-day stage race that takes riders across the Western Cape province of South Africa. It is unique in that it includes luxury accommodation in boutique facilities, deliciously prepared food, all washed down with a great selection of amazing South African wines and beer. The current surge in COVID-19 globally has unfortunately led to the cancellation of the 2021 edition of the Transcape Mountain Bike Experience. In response, the Transcape team has entered into a unique collaboration with the Canadian-based HBL cycling team to host the very first virtual Transcape on the Zwift platform. The HPL cycling team was founded in 2018 by Paul Cutting and has grown to be one of the most dynamic masters racing teams in Canada. HPL has grown to become a leader in virtual racing and group rides on the Zwift platform in Canada. The expert guidance of the HPL founder Paul Cutting, the Transcape team is proud to offer the virtual Transcape race that has four challenging stages during the month of February in 2021. The first stage is scheduled for the 6th of February 2021 and coincides with the actual date that the real world Transcape would have had its first day of racing in George, South Africa. In the tradition of the Transcape mountain bike experience, the first stage is essentially on a gravel route, that of the Serpentine 8 course on the Zwift platform. It includes loops through the jungle and the Mayan runes and makes for an interesting opening stage. Make sure that you choose a mountain bike for this first stage as this is the fastest bike for the race. Stage two is one that is designed to test the legs of even the strongest climbers. The race begins in downtown Watopia and then heads out for the hills. The epic King of the Mountains is approached via the reverse route. Just when you think the climb is complete, the race then heads up the bonus hill, which has an average gradient of 11%. Once over the top, you can super tuck your way down the epic King of the Mountains to downtown Watopia to complete the stage. The third stage follows the San and Sequoia route through the deserts of Watopia. The desert offers a flat route, so make sure that you get into a good peloton to optimize your draft. Save your energy for the climbs through Titan's Grove and be prepared for a roller coaster descent. The final and queen stage of this race series follows the Three Sisters route. The first challenge of the route is the hilly King of the Mountains with a short but challenging climb. Then find your own rhythm on the epic King of the Mountain forward route and be prepared for another bite of the bonus hill. This stage ends with a third climb 
up the volcano king of the mountains. Visit the HPL Cycling's website for details of the virtual Transcape race. Be sure to register for lots of riding and some interesting prizes.